All right, it's an exploding community here in Bear County. We're talking about Alamo Ranch. As part of our Know My Neighborhood series, we highlighted its growth and the growing pains that come with it. The Bear County Sheriff's Office added a new substation there last week to address safety concerns. As our Daniela Ibarra explains, the county is now doing something about another missing resource. Outside of the hustle and bustle, Alamo Ranch is peaceful. That's part of the reason you guys live out here is because it's exactly. nature. -y. Exactly. Jordan Wagner says there aren't many places for kids to play. It'd be nice to have somewhere closer. I mean, there's not anything close out here for a public park out here. The county owns this huge lot of land out here in Alamo Ranch, and we're right at the edge of it. You can see by this marker right here. Now, the county, they plan to build this park here. They just don't know what it'll look like yet. We need to make sure that we're serving the needs of our constituents um, with resources and amenities, and we need to be a better, um, just a healthier Bear County together. Precinct 1 Commissioner Rebecca Clay Flores says so far around $3 million is being invested. She wants people who live nearby to give their input. This really needs to be a community park, um, a community vision, and we want our residents to take ownership because this is going to be their park. The land the county has to work with is just off Tally Road near Medio Drive. There's lots of room to change, which Jordan says neighbors worry about. They like the nature feel of it. Some kids, you know, like to chase fireflies here. The trees are very old here, so they're very worried about the tree preservation. It's very hard to keep everyone happy, but we do the best that we can. Danielle Ibarra, KSAT 12 News. The commissioner actually wants to hear from people about what to do with that park. She's planning an engagement event next week for the location and time. Head to KSAT.com.